untie him. Mama, what's going on? Mama, what's happening? I present this to you. No thanks. I don't need it. How dare you stop me like that? Please, 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 Who does she think she is? Such arrogance. Just because the God has blessed her with a little talent. Sa'aswala. It is a great talent. We must acknowledge that. Her voice is the most sonorous ever. The most sonorous. Please. Let's hear what, eh? Don't you know you're a wonderful singer? Me? Yes, that's your problem. No self-confidence. I'm not half as good as woman. She's truly blessed by the gods. We are all blessed by the gods, okay? But I can't seem to heal. Can't you see the difference? Nengi, even if the gods blessed you now, you won't even know it. That's because you're too timid. I'm not timid. I'm not timid. What is it? Your career cannot be more important than a marriage. Oh yes it is. My talent is blessed by the girls and it's more important to me than anything else. My dear, we, we want to have been married a long time ago. Look, Harry, please, do you mind? You're distracting my attention. I'm trying to make my face perfect here. You know I have a calling to attend to. Oh, my God! Now, look what you've done. Now, how to wipe my face and start all over again? Hi. Hey. Oh. I'll go. And I'll come back when you are ready. Please go. A wonderful voice. It sounds so sweet. My ears. Thank you, Dagogo. Don't stop singing. Continue. Even the birds will love your voice. You tease me, Dagogo. No, but it's the truth. 
Before you discovered your gift from the gods. And I have often told you that if you must visit me, you should let me know. <gasps> what is wrong with you? Can't you just do as I say? I'm not your slave, Goma. Neither are you the peace. Just the son of the clan's head. You're very lucky to know me, you know. Remember this. That I knew you before you became whatever you are, you are today. I knew you. Don't you ever forget that. Ever. It is that creature of Boma that our clan head son had to go to. What a pity. What a pity indeed. I wonder why he didn't come to me. I could make a better wife, you know. Or even me. I would be a better one. And what makes you think I won't be a better one? Because I Girls, know. please. He has made his choice. Just pray to God to find you your own man. What are you saying? Don't you remember he's a clan head son? But he's betrothed to someone else. It's no use fighting over another woman's property. And to imagine how she treats him. As if he's a wrong or something. As if she's even doing him a favor. Che, that girl is wicked. <laughs> Our own clan head son. I don't blame her. So if he didn't cross over, all this won't happen. That's true. That's true. Yes, Swala. Um, uh, Nengi. Yeah? I hear came for your hand in marriage. Ha! Huh? My God, good news travels fast. He came just yesterday, you girls have heard already. Ah, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. I want to be here. We have our ears to the ground. Mm. Not like you that don't like to gossip or talk. Anyway, he did come to ask for my hand in marriage. And I said no, of course. Ha! Huh. After deflowering all the girls in this village, then he comes to ask a treasure like you for your hand in marriage. Do you know he was responsible for deflowering my cousin? Until now, she can't even get a good bride price. I know his story. I never even considered him for a second. Good for you. Well, I'm tired of doing this here. Finish. Voila. It it's just one more. The thing is not doing, the trade is finished. Some villagers have got some nice gifts for you. They are in the sitting room. They have done well. Ah uh ah, -uh. won't you come out and thank them? You can thank them for me. You know I'm tired now. Right? Mm -hmm. Not you, you fool. I'm talking to my mother. Mother, please. I will. But it would have been better if you do it yourself. After I didn't ask them for anything. Did you say something? No, mother. Out now, you can come with me. To where? I'm going to see my mother's friend. She prepared a paper for me the last time I visited. I just want to thank her with these peanuts. Okay, thank you. 
You have such a wonderful heart. The man that will marry you in the future will be a very lucky man. Well, I just know I'm grateful to God for everything good that happens to me. And to man too. Anyway, you still haven't told me. What kind of man would you want to marry? A prince, of course. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> one whose sight will make my heart beat faster and faster by the minute. To do me. To do me. <laughs> That will be your dream. Of course, I know that. Such things don't happen to people like me. Let's go. I've heard of your voice for so long and your incredible talent. Indeed, it's a great honor to meet with you. Yes. Why can't two simple villagers just compliment me and be on your way? Ha! Must you keep me here for an hour? Let's be on our way. <laughs> there is nothing we will not see in this village. Can you imagine? Eh? Let's go. Leave that peacock. <laughs> Imagine, hey. nonsense. Imagine, what does she teach you? I'm even getting her shoes. She's doing that. She's because of our boys. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, what is it? Nengi, please, if my father comes to ask you where I was last night, please, can you help me tell him I was at your place, please? Ah, Otonyi, are you asking me to lie? No, no, now, please, now, just tell me. You know you're my friend, please. I beg you, please. All right, all right, I will help you. But I must tell you, I don't like what you're doing. I don't like it. How can you go and be staying with a man alone in his house? You're not his wife. And whatever it is the two of you do when you're alone together, it's not it's not I right. No, we're not doing anything. You know he's my friend. And besides, we are planning to get married. And see, we're even thinking of running away if my parents does not agree. And please now, I beg you, please. All right, I said I will. But I, I won't do it again. Thank I, you. I don't like this kind of thing. Thank you. I like this thank you so much. Please go. Thank you. Eh? Greet your father for me, okay? Lord, is it not heavy? No, I, I, I'm already home. Thank you, my daughter. Bring your wife. Go well. That is enough, young woman. Ha! It is obvious you're enchanted by Sukari. And for your information, he's already hooked by the peacock. Please tell me something I don't know. That alien looking woman. Let's 
go. Can we go? Ah! Be gentle on my skin, you fool! Do you think you're found the cassava? I'm sorry. Sorry for yourself. So, have you thought of our marriage date yet? Ah! Oh, be gentle on my skin. There isn't any difference between you and that thing. Please be gentle. I can see you have no respect for me, Boma. to get it for you now. <laughs> All right, I'll get it. Then I better be on my way. We are wicked. Is that all you can say? <laughs> May the blood of the child be your daughter. You will not see your blood. Oh, my child. You, you, you are very wicked woman. You have killed my child. Why did you come so late? You villagers are so incredible. You should be glad I even came. Oh, my God, I can't stand simple villagers. Make it go I will touch you! Please <laughs> stop crying. Oh my Stop crying. Oh my God. What is wrong with you nowadays? Tell me. You are seeing a man. No. Shut up. I know you have seen a man. One of these days, I will seriously deal with you. Look at her. Mama, my child, I want to talk to you. What is it, mother? From generation to generation, this gift you have has been passed down from one clan to another. I never dreamt it would come to my home. It must be a blessing the gods pour for me from start. It is lifelong honor, something we should be grateful for all the days of our life. But mother, is there a point to all this? Yes, my child. You must act grateful at all times to be the one that was chosen by the gods. Don't let time cause you to lose what you have. Price goes before destruction. I have told you, let the gods hear my voice. Oh, 
Light is like the water keeps flowing and flowing, washes away but comes again. Life flows, yes, it flows. Light is like the water keeps flowing and flowing. She's a wave that comes alive Like the wind Yeah And we went all the way to your house. They told us we were here. Oh, no, I know. I'm sorry. My father isn't feeling well. And I promised him I'll be back home early to take care of him. He has no wife to lose his aging boy. Hey, but you have called us. It's okay. I'm sorry. Okay, let's stop talking about this. Nindi, have you heard? Heard what? You mean you've not heard? Heard what? The peacock. She has done it again. Did what? She has murdered a girl in the ah, boy, little boy in the village. Murder. What is it's not murder. It's not murder. What is it then? It is murder. If she had come when they called her to come and sing, the boy wouldn't have died. But now he's dead. So what is that? It's not murder. She has killed him. Hey. Swala. No murder. And guess what she was doing? What was she doing? Painting her face. No murder. And guess what she was doing? What was she doing? Painting her face. Can you imagine? Painting her face. And it's not mother. What is it? Painting. You know she's Please. Please, 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 please. We are all beautiful. Even you, you are even beautiful. So what are you talking about? I stop talking about her and wash. You should keep talking about the boy. Please. It has already been done. Let's go. You said you finished. I finished here. Let me just scream to my head. <laughs> To you, Swala. Oh my god! So, Kari, you're welcome. So, what do I owe this visit? I just dropped by to see your brother at the time. Oh. You just missed him now. He went to the event and then he got down Oh, in that case, I'll be on my way. But so do you remember to tell him I called? And I hope to see you at the event at our place. Yes, you will. I hope to see your lovely face again. Okay, Sokari. I will be coming with my friends. Good. Bye-bye. Trouble me about this marriage issue. Because we are not getting any younger. 
That's why. Speak for yourself. I'm, I should be playing with my first son by now. And I should be married to the prince by now. Oh, I see. Okay. You want to get married to the son of the king? Don't I deserve that? I'm the most suffocating lady in this world. So I'm not good enough for you. Is that what you're saying? Don't put words into my mouth. I know what I'll do. I will talk to your parents to call off this engagement. I shall meet with them. Please go. My eyes are on the place. The man with every girl dreams to be married. That's the one I want. Not some stupid one that so I'm bigger than that. Father, your situation is getting worse. We must do something about this. Don't worry. Don't worry, my son. The roots are very powerful. I'll, I'll be cured in no time. No, Father. I insist we seek other means. The roots are not working. We must do something, Father. What other means? <coughs> just, just give me one week and then... <coughs> oh, Father, speak no more. Speak no more, Father. Please, calm down. I greet you. Oh, I remember you from the clan head's party last week. You tried singing when the clan head asked for those who could sing. <laughs> Don't fool yourself, my dear. Concentrate your energy on some other things. <laughs> Definitely not singing. Why are we listening to this? Maybe please, let's go. And for your information, she sings just as good as you, if not better. Rubbish. Let's go. Let's go! She's such a wonderful singer. If she says I can't sing, then I truly can't sing. Nonsense. Nengi, Mama is just jealous. Huh? That's it. Yes. And if you can just sing more often, see, your fame will be all over this kingdom. I don't think I want to sing. I don't want to sing. Especially when somebody is listening. Are you serious? How did I get to you like this? Anyway, I will still go to Bani Bani Gossi. Are we still going? You better start singing. My daughter, sometimes when I remember my late wife, your mother, 
I got so sad and downcast. I missed her a lot. I miss her too, Father. But it's been such a long time. You really shouldn't let it bother you like this. I try not to. But I find myself thinking about her from time to time. She was a wonderful woman. Yes, she was, Father. She was. And you are just like her in all things. Blessing me, son. No, Father. I, I can't sing. I'm not singing. I'm not a good singer. I don't want to sing ever again. Who told you that? You've been a source of upliftment to my heart all the time. Father, let me go and make your drink for you. I just wanted to startle you a little. You startled me, all right. Um, let me get some chairs. What is that? But you know my brother is not around. Uh, I know. I came to say hello to you. Me? I'm honored. But you must stay. Let me get some chairs. So at least I can give you some color notes. Uh, don't bother. I, I'm just passing through. I'll soon be on my way, OK? I don't want my people to know about my ill health. I don't want them to be afraid. Okay, Father. And I worry, my son. I worry about you not taking the bride now. Maybe I should send my guards to comb all the clans and the villages and find you a befitting bride. No, Father. I need you to get well first. I will get married. Yes, to the woman of my choice, at the right time. But right now, Father, I must proceed to Akiyama to fetch this sonorous woman. Don't go. But if you must, go with gods. Remember who you are. Yes, thank you, my daughter. You cook as well as your mother. Father, you tease me like this every time I cook for you. It is the truth. Now hurry up to Akayama and deliver the message to my friend I sent you before it starts to rain. All right, Father. I will. Thank you. Why don't you go out for a walk? Take some fresh air. Stop nursing me. I'll be fine on my own. No, Father. No, no, no. But me, no, but. Take that walk. I feel the evening breeze. All right, Father. But I will be back soon. No. Take your time. And don't forget to go with the gods. Of course I will, Father. Take care of yourself.
please, let me help her. No. Are you alright? I hope you didn't hurt yourself, lovely one. A very lovely one indeed. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay, thank you. Where do you stay? So I can walk you home to make sure you're safe. Um, no, I, I have noticed that you're, you're royal and I'm just a simple villager. I don't deserve this kind of generosity from a noble one like you. I must be on my way now. Wait, wait. Who are you? Who is your father? She's not from our village, my lord. And she's not from a notable family as I can see. I'm not from a notable family like you rightly said. I must be on my way now. Wait! 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 Not at all what people think of him. I thought he would be proud and arrogant, but he's not. Yeah. <laughs> he's so, he's just, he's gentle. He's so gentle. And he's just, he's nice. I don't know. <laughs> Not for people like me. Yes. <laughs> then you shouldn't bother dreaming of that. <laughs> Nen, don't get carried away. You know who you are. I see. You are just a commoner. Yes. Eh. Finish. That's all we are. Mm. King's son. Commoner. They don't go together. I told you. Lolia! 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 Hey! Where are you? Where are the jewelry? How? You have misplaced them. How can you do such a thing? What is he screaming all about? Calm down. Mama. Mother, you know I can't calm down. When this idiot that was for me have misplaced my jewels. <laughs> well, if you can't find them, get your teeth and move. The family that needs your help are waiting for you. No, forget about the jewelries. No, no, mother. You know I can't go anywhere until I find my jewelries. I have to be a god properly. You must go. You must go. I have another person who died. Mother, I will not go until I find my jewelry. It's yours. So, where are you my jewelries? I'm sorry, I kept them inside there, but I can't find it. I'm confused. You're still standing. Come on, get out of the way now, you stupid thing. Hey! Don't fool yourself, my dear. Are you alright? I hope you didn't hurt yourself, lovely one. A very lovely one, indeed. She's not from our village, my lord. And she's not from a notable family as I can see. Hey, you startled me. I mean, your mind was very far away. Tell me, what's the trouble with you? Nothing. 
nothing, Father. Nothing? There's nothing on my mind. From a notable family, like you rightly said, I'm on my own. Hey! Lolia! 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 Why do you creep up behind me every time like that? I'm sorry. It wasn't intentional. Always sorry. I am very fair. Am I not? Yes, you are. I'm the most beautiful maiden in this kingdom. Hmm. Not so. Yes, it's so. Then why haven't you told me this before? Because. Because. Because what? Speak! Don't be tongue tied. Tell me, is it true or false these claims I make? They are true. Then who else? Deserves to be married to the prince of this great kingdom? Yes, it's in the last one. Mm -hmm. Of course, me. I just have to devise a means to make him notice me. Not so. Yes, it is. Hmm. Leave! Fubara! Yes, my prince. I am going to send you on a mission. And I want you to be discreet about it. What is it, my prince? Remember the maiden we met along the way. That evening I was taking a long walk. Um, the one who stumbled and you said was not from a notable family. Oh, I now remember. What about her, my prince? Fubara, I trust you. That's why I'm sending you on this mission. I want you to find out everything about her. Her name, her family, her village. I want everything before nightfall. My prince, but... Fubara! Go. Do as I say. At once, my prince. You're so lucky. <laughs> mm -hmm. I have 
are good news too. How did the world agree? For you to be married to somebody. Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> That's wonderful! <laughs> That's wonderful. Whoa! Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, Hello. what about you, Nengi? Are you still waiting for the thing? My prince, of course. <laughs> <laughs> prince, <Anyways>. please. <laughs> you get your prince. At least I got Sokari. Oh, ah. okay. Dreamer. <laughs> to tell you that I have found a bride for myself. You have found a bride? Yes, Father. She's young. She's beautiful. And what's more, Father? She's very attractive. What family is she from? Who is her father? No, Father. She's not from a noble, notable family. You mean she does not have royal blood in her? No. You will not do that. You must not forget that in my prince. Your father, prince. Father, calm down. We'll talk about that some other time. Your health is more important right now. This sonorous lady, she asked the guards to come tomorrow. I, I believe she will come with them when they come back. They were discreet. No one must know that the king is not feeling too strong. Yes, father. They were discreet. They did not wear guard clothes when they left. Okay. Father, rest now. I'll come check you later. yourself. The people that need your help are in the city. Don't you come and talk to them. But mother, you don't expect me to see them on a do I was simply making sure my adornments were in place before I see them. But this is our home. Why must you put this heavy adornment just for you to attend to visit us? This thing is getting into your head though. I have told you, God, hear my voice. I know why you're here. For a reply. Well, I have decided to answer to your call. Who do you say he is? A man who is very ill, Sonora's one. <laughs> and he has no name? Anyway, you say you are from another village. Yes, we are. In that case, I will need gifts of 10 yards of white loin cloth, 5 bangles of ivory, and 15 tubers of yam. Did you get that? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, generous one. You may now leave.
have certainly invoked the anger of the gods with your attitude. You place a demand for a call. They were met, yet you refused to go for the call. What has come over you? But mother, I said I was tired. Don't I have a right to be tired again? Mama, asking for a prize for a call is bad enough. People give gifts for appreciation, not for a call. I have said my own oh no. mother. I will go tomorrow. Let them wait. You better go. Let the girls hear my voice. Oh. Your little mama is what I am. There's no other like me. Beautiful mama is what I am. What kind of woman is this? Does she know is a king she keeps waiting like this? My prince, don't forget the king's identity was meant to be discreet. She's of a terrible character. She shouldn't keep anyone waiting like this. She's wicked and proud. My prince, maybe we should make an open announcement. With a handsome reward for whoever is able to make the king well again. I want you to get me clothes befitting for commoners. What does my prince intend? Don't ask questions! Yes, I've come from a distant land. Well, can I offer you some water to wash your face? Oh, or no, 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 thank you very much. You're very kind. What is your name? My name is Tamilo Nengio Furi. Nengi, let's go. Oh, this, I am looking for the house of the Sonorous Maiden. Can you show me the place? Oh, Boma, um... Uh, when you get to the end of the road, our house is two buildings by the left. We are going to the next school. Thank you very much. Look, your face looks very familiar. Like I've met you before. No, I don't think so. But take me anyway. You are a very kind woman. Thank you. Thank you. Never go. Are you bargaining into my compound like that? I'm sorry, sonorous one, but I'm here on behalf of my father. You see, he's very ill. I'm sure the people in my village would have come to see you. Please, come, come and help him. You think your presence here will make me have sympathy on you and run off with you like that? No, sonorous one, please. But my father is very, very ill. He has a rare illness. We've tried all forms of herbs. It hasn't worked. Please, come quickly. Please. Come quickly. Are you the prince or the king? Because those are the only people I deal with. Even at that. They don't order me around. I'm bigger than that. Prince or the king? Please, don't waste my time. I am on my way out for my evening walk. I will answer to your call in my own time.
it's better to have a healthy king than one who is dead because you don't want your people to be afraid. We must make an announcement immediately, Father, throughout the whole kingdom. Do what you want. Guards! Yes, my prince. Get the town crier at once! All right, my lord. May you find her when you need one. Thank you. What did you do to my daughter? My daughter was very sick when I left her with you. Her body was very hot. And now the yellow in her eyes has come down. What did you do to her? Did you give her any help? I didn't give her anything. I just mainly sang to her when she was restless. Oh, you sang to her and she's well now. My baby. The day that I visited my daughter. Uh, let me be going, ma. My father is waiting for me. Oh, thank you. That is kind of you. Thank you. May God bless you, my daughter. Oh, my baby, my baby. May God bless her. Too. Thank God for this man. Who are taking care of my baby? My baby. The sick ones are calling the weak ones. Need your touch. It's a bubble bath. So what? Be real. no be she. She. We look on. So. I'm sorry. Your I don't know what is happening. I must really be tired from the long journey. Okay. Take her to all of the rooms where she could rest. Take them off. I'll give you time. I'm sorry. I don't know what it is, but... I must... I really wish I was called earlier concerning the king's health. I'm really sorry. It's okay, you can go to the room. God! God! Yes, my friends. Go and call the time cars. Yes, Inform friend. him that anyone who can heal my father by any means is welcome to the palace. Why not consider the king's call? Just give it a try. Okay, you don't push me. Do you want me to go and embarrass myself? Mm -hmm. What is embarrassing about that? It's not about the voice. Can't you remember the baby you tended to? How she was cured before her mother came back? That could have been a coincidence. <laughs> no, no. What about your father's aching bones? Have you forgotten? Listen, Nengi. It's not about whether you have it or you don't have it. Let's just go and give it a try. At least, let's give you the opportunity to meet with the prince. See if the sonorous one is ready for us. Yes, sir. Okay. Your right. Highness, there are some people out in the courtyard who wants to see. Did they state their mission? Yes, Your Highness. The king's call. They have come to answer the call. Then send them in at once. Yes, Thank Your you. Highness. 
My prince. She's a running herself and we be with us when she's through. What kind of God created that woman? We greet you, Your Highness. Lovely one. It's you, isn't it? Yes, Your Highness. We believe she can help the king. She can sing yes. and healing will come. Please, Your Highness, help me out. We have experienced it from her before. Please, Your Highness, let her sing. You sing? You're gifted? Your Highness, yes, 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 my lord. Um, she's blessed with the gifts, and that is why we have come to help the king. Your Highness, I think I'm ready and well left. I like privacy with the king. You again? How dare you speak rudely before me? I'm, I'm sorry, Your Highness, for being rude. I just want to concentrate on the king. All I want is for my father to be healed. What's so hard to understand there? The sick ones are calling. The weak ones need a touch. The sick ones are calling. The sick ones to make them strong, to be able to smile again. We look on to you, to make them strong, to be able to smile again. My Lord! She's truly gifted. See, the king. My dear, you have brought healing to my soul. You will be mightily rewarded. Behold, your bride. Father. She's the one I've been telling you about. Do you want to be my wife? Yes, she will. Yes, she will. She will. Call the town crier. Make the announcement. All through my kingdom. Announce my son's engagement. <laughs> This is Laura Hart. 
I am honored that your ministry wants me to minister. Yes. I shall be there. Yes, thank you very much. Oh, yeah.